Hello everyone, welcome back to A World Reborn. In the regrowth mod pack, of course, we're going to be testing out my new sword today. A manulin cleaver with life stealing and 11.5 hearts worth of damage. Probably not the greatest. I it, it's It's only got one paper item on it. Other than that, there's nothing increasing its modifier, so. It's, it's got a little ways to go. I figured we can test it out against Wither, see how well it does. Still gonna be using my. my crossbow. Alright, Wither, come on. Time to fight again. I hate how you fly straight above me. It makes it really hard to hit you. And you're down on it. That just does a decent amount of damage. Took out the weather pretty easily that time. I'll go with it. Not even sure if I needed these, but it doesn't hurt to have them. And I didn't even have to go use up use any backup weapons. Which is always a really positive thing. Ah, there's the star main reason that I was doing this fight because we're going to be setting up for a different fight <sighs> okay so this is the fight that we were preparing for and this should not be on my hotbar I said it shouldn't be on my hotbar damn, damn these incense sticks okay so this is fight against the Gaia Guardian. I don't really know how exactly we're supposed to do this. Turn to steal as a sacrifice. Right click the beacon block with the, a Terra Steel in shift right click. Okay, that's where I was wrong. And there's some epic music. Okay, I think I can only damage him with melee. Think. Maybe. <laughs> this guy is a pain in the ass. I am seriously injured. How am I so injured? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, the good news is that the fight ends pretty much immediately. So I don't have to worry about losing my stuff. But how was I so injured? <laughs> I kind of expected that to happen because first time trying to fight him, I don't really know what I'm doing at all. He wrecks. <laughs> the whole blindness thing is I'm going to say the most annoying part of that little fight. Why is the music still going? There shouldn't be music. <laughs> the guy is gone. <laughs> uh, my elementum armor didn't really protect me at all. My flask of shielding was 
basically worthless. <laughs> I couldn't even get in range to try using my cleaver. That, that was kind of the saddest part. Hmm. Music's good though. At least it's at least it is music from the mod itself, so I don't have to worry about the music. <sighs> right, I'm going to make some healing potions, and we will see how well that changes things. Okay, I'm ready to give this thing another shot. Got a couple more Terra Steel ingots. This time I made some healing potions. I don't think it's really going to help because I still don't know what I'm doing. But why not, right? Okay, let's see how quickly I die this time. Why does the ground turn purple? Yep, bows don't work on him. I'm not getting withered at all. Oh, there we go. I think it's this little pink fog that actually withers you. And blinds you. So yeah, as long as I keep jumping, I have less of a chance of getting withered. Oop. Okay, I'm getting this guy's tactics a little bit. Ow, why am I getting launched around like that? What's happening? <laughs> what was knocking me into the air? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> uh, damn. Okay. So, I'll give this one more shot. I'm out of Terra Steel Ingots after this one, so I guess I'll be the end of me trying to take this guy on. But at least I'm learning what the fight is like. Watch out for the purple gas. Hidden teleporting is the worst part of this fight. I have no idea why I'm being thrown around. Oop, there's the purple gas. So how well you are able to do in this fight is kind of randomized based on how much you get hit by the purple gas. I'm really curious what the heck is hitting me there because I don't see any projectiles being thrown at me. I do have all my particles on, right? Let's see, video settings, minimum smooth line, particles are decreased. I think I need all my particles on so I can see what I'm actually being hit with, with that guy. I'm gonna guess like, uh, the fairies. Or something like that. need some food so I can actually run out to my grave. Yeah, th this fight is actually a lot trickier than I kind of expected, but I th I'm thinking of ways to actually fight this guy now. Because now that I, now that I paid attention to the actual arena itself and what was causing me to become withered, I 
I'm thinking I might be able to make a few blocks that are just kind of floating in the air, which I can use to avoid the purple gas. Yeah, I still have to jump down in order to actually fight, but staying out of the purple gas has let me last longer. Hmm. I'd like to point out that the elementium has basically done absolutely nothing for me. But I know there's a whole bunch of stuff for Britannia that I do not have at all, which probably will help me do this fight even better. So I think we will end this video here. And... I will look at the various equipment that I can create in Botania. Like under the mystical items, like it, this thing probably has anything, but uh, There's a spellbinding cloth. That's not actually going to help. Maybe I should be using the Terra Blade for this. I don't know. Now, here is baubles and accessories. That's what I wanted. That's nothing. Hook of judgment. You have to beat the guy of spirit for that. Great fairy ring. <clears throat> Increases chance for Pixie to spawn when the wearer is hit. And I I believe that pixies do have a chance of healing you as well, so. So that's probably worth investing in for this fight. Anyway, I am going to cut here and I will create a few items and then we will get back to this in the next video. So take care, guys, and goodbye. Actually. That didn't take as long as I was expecting it would. I have plenty of resources on hand to make this stuff pretty fast, so it's already made. Less than 10 minutes later, so I'll just, what the heck, go one more time. I'm really, really running low on my mana, though, so this is going to kind of be my last. Hurrah. Because, well, it takes a little while for the mana to go. I need to figure out a better mana system. I really do. I need golems. So, win or lose against this guy this time. Oh dear, I am out of regen. Let me fix that quick. Okay, so let's go over what we have quick. What I have equipped now is... A ring of far reach, which is supposed to increase the range of your melee attack by like three blocks, so I should be able to hit the guy easier. We have the great fairy ring, which means that fairies will be more likely to activate when I am wearing my elementium armor, and the tectonic girdle, which is supposed to prevent me from being knocked around so easily. So, here we go. And of course I'm doing this at night, which is probably the worst time to do this fight. Because he is black and it is very difficult to see anything that's happening. Okay, avoid the purple gas, avoid... Oh, there's purple gas everywhere! Purple gas is everywhere! 
Where did he go? Now he's over here. I don't seem to be hitting him with increased range. Hey zombie, can you test this for me? I can hit you. Oh, purple gas. Teleported here. Come on. Yeah, I should not have done this at night. <laughs> and I'm dead. Ugh. All right, so new plan of action. I'm going to kill the wither like 20 times, make a whole bunch of heart canisters, get my life up really high, as high as I can get it, and then we'll try again. Take care, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.